AI robots are evolving at an unbelievable pace, and 2025 is bringing some mind-blowing innovations. Imagine flipping on your TV and seeing an army of robots dancing better than your favorite TikTok stars. Well, that's exactly what happened at China's Spring Festival Gala, where Unitree's H1 robots stole the show. Meanwhile, in the race for the best humanoid hand, Tesla Optimus is facing serious competition. Elon Musk admits the challenge, but Clone Robotics claims their robotic hand is lighter, stronger, and more affordable. And NVIDIA and Carnegie Mellon are teaming up to create robotic athletes, machines that can run, jump, and maybe even outcompete humans in sports. And Figure AI is making a bold move by ditching its partnership with OpenAI and building its own custom AI model. This could change everything for humanoid robots and how they interact with the world. First up, let's talk about one of the most jaw-dropping moments in robotics so far this year. At China's Spring Festival Gala, a group of Unitree H1 humanoid robots took the stage, not for a tech demo, but to dance. These robots weren't just performing pre-programmed movements. They were flipping handkerchiefs, staying in sync with professional dancers, and keeping perfect rhythm to the music. The level of precision was so incredible that some viewers had to do a double take. What makes this even more impressive is that just a few years ago, humanoid robots struggled with basic walking. Now, thanks to advanced AI motion control and real-time balance adjustments, these robots can perform complex choreographed routines on live television. Unitree's H1 robots use high-speed actuators and advanced AI-driven movement prediction to anticipate and adjust their movements in real time, making them far more fluid and natural than older robot models. And this is just the beginning. AI-driven robotics is moving beyond industrial tasks and stepping into entertainment, sports, and even creative fields. At this rate, we might soon see humanoid robots starring in performances, competing in dance competitions, or even becoming celebrity entertainers. I'm excited to see what the future holds for robotics, especially with companies like Unitree Robotics leading the way. I think we can expect to see even more amazing things from these robots in the years to come. Next, we're checking out Figure AI, the company that's building Figure 2, a robot that can be used in homes and businesses. Figure AI just announced that they're ditching their deal with OpenAI to build their own AI. That's a big deal because it means they're serious about making their robots smart. Figure AI's decision to build its own AI is a bold move, but it could pay off in the long run. By developing its own AI, Figure AI will have complete control over the development of its robots. This will allow them to create robots that are more tailored to the needs of their customers. Figure AI is also betting that its AI will be superior to OpenAI's. If they're right, then Figure AI will have a major competitive advantage. It's still early days, but Figure AI's decision to build its own AI is a sign that the company is serious about becoming a leader in the robotics industry. It shows that Figure AI is committed to innovation. By developing its own AI, Figure AI is showing that it's not afraid to take risks. This is a sign that the company is willing to invest in the future of robotics. It gives Figure AI more control over the development of its robots. By developing its own AI, Figure AI will have complete control over the development of its robots. This will allow them to create robots that are more tailored to the needs of their customers. Overall, Figure AI's decision to build its own AI is a bold move that could pay off in the long run. It's a sign that the company is serious about becoming a leader in the robotics industry. Now, when we talk about humanoid robots, one of the biggest challenges isn't just walking, it's creating hands that work like human hands. It all started when Elon Musk took to X, formerly Twitter, to boast about the next generation Tesla Optimus Gen 3 hand. Musk claimed that Tesla's new robotic hand is so incredibly advanced that it makes a Fabergé egg, one of the most intricate pieces of craftsmanship ever made, look simple in comparison. That's a bold statement, but considering how complex the human hand is, he might not be wrong. Meanwhile, Clone Robotics wasn't having it. Shortly after Musk's post, Clone Robotics clapped back, claiming their own hydraulic-powered robotic hand is not only lighter, stronger, and cheaper than Tesla's, but also has a soft, 
plush texture, making it ideal for tasks that require precision and a human-like touch. So, who's winning the race? Right now, Tesla has the big name, resources, and deep AI integration, but Clone Robotics is making serious waves by focusing entirely on solving the hand problem. If they succeed, we might see humanoid robots with hands capable of handling delicate tasks like cooking, repairing electronics, or even performing surgery. This battle is more than just who builds the best hand. It's about who creates the most practical, cost-effective, and scalable solution for the future of humanoid robots. Will Tesla's AI-powered humanoid hands dominate the industry? Or will clone robotics softer, more adaptable design prove to be the better choice for real-world applications? And finally, get ready for robot athletes. NVIDIA and Carnegie Mellon University are developing a training program that will allow robots to mimic top athletes. Imagine robots that can run faster, jump higher, and play sports better than us. It's not hard to imagine a future where robots are competing in the Olympics. At the core of this breakthrough is NVIDIA's AI-powered chips, which simulate and analyze thousands of athletic movements in real time. These chips allow robots to study biomechanics, make split-second adjustments, and even anticipate future motions, just like professional athletes. Carnegie Mellon, on the other hand, brings decades of robotics expertise, developing hardware and control systems that let robots execute complex movements efficiently. The training program is called ASAP, which stands for Athletic Skills for Articulated Robots. It uses a combination of artificial intelligence and machine learning to teach robots how to perform complex athletic movements. The robots are trained using a variety of methods, including motion capture, simulation, and real-world practice. They're also given feedback from human coaches. The goal of the program is to create robots that are not only physically capable of performing athletic movements, but also have the cognitive abilities to make decisions and strategize during competition. If this technology keeps advancing, we might soon see a future where AI-driven robots are competing in professional sports. Imagine an all-robot basketball league, AI-powered soccer teams, or humanoid robots trained for extreme obstacle courses. So, what do you think? Are AI robots evolving too fast? From humanoid robots dancing like professionals to AI-powered machines training like elite athletes, the future is looking more futuristic than ever. Subscribe for more deep dives into AI, robotics, and the future of technology.